At 3-0, DeCoin is another unbeaten team with very high hopes. The Indians have started the season off well. They plan to keep it that way. Standing in their way, a Benton team that's always tough to play at home. The Rangers trying to make a statement and land an upset at the home of the Rangers. Let's see if they can do it. Military pre Appreciation Night at Tabor Field. The Rangers wearing special camouflage jerseys for this one. First year head coach for DuCoin, Logan Spain, formerly of Pinckneyville, bringing his 3-0 Indians to Benton for the first time since the late 90s. Opening drive of the game for the Rangers, quarterback Tiffin Kazugas goes deep. Great catch here by Grant Owens. First down, Benton, they're on the move. Later on in the same drive, Rangers looking into the ground game, but DuCoin defense having other ideas. Joseph Gulimi with the big hit, forcing the fumble. Cameron Ford there to recover. The ensuing drive stalling for DuCoin. On fourth and long from their own 14-yard line, quarterback Camden Waller, instead of punting, hits P.J. Winters. And P.J. open on the slant. He breaks one tackle. He's gone. 86 yards later, it's a house call. That puts the Indians up 7-0. Let's trickle into the second quarter. DuCoin still up 7-3, clinging to a four-point lead, looking for more deep in Benton territory. Waller is forced to scramble. Does a great job of keeping the play alive, and that gives Brandon Jokish some time to get open and into the end zone for the score. It's another Indian touchdown. DuCoin hanging on in the second half to win a close one. 21-15, they remain undefeated on the season.